I am trying to be the first um, legally blind person to sail around the world. I'm 17,000 miles into the voyage, so that's how I ended up being here to talk about GPS with you guys. We've got two things going on today. One, um, a goal to learn a little bit about GPS and how people that are blind um, use GPS, both in the city and or on the water. And then the second goal is to take this big bad monster boat and go sailing. And um, you guys can be crew and help, or you guys can be passengers and chill. It's really up to what you guys decide you want to do today. My name is Bill Barkley. I'm deafblind and I'm at No Barrier because I'm here to talk about and show people how assistive technologies and hearing and vision change the way disabled people live, work, and play. <laughs> I wanted to learn about the GPS stuff because it's really cool and I do like boating and it's a neat way to find out how the technology can be brought into my life. And I've been legally blind since birth. When I was 13 I realized I was really not going to ever be able to drive a car and some friends took me out to a, a lake, a small Boy Scout lake that had the little sailboats. And it was my first chance to drive something on my own. And it was, it was love at first sail. You know, it was my chance to drive something and, and be in control of it. And um, I've never stopped loving sailing since. There's this piece, which is called a Voice Note QT. And it's like a computer. It's a note taker type device, kind of like a PDA, like, like using a Blackberry or the GPS technology basically, the nice thing is, as you say, you can program coordinates. And then when you program the coordinates, it tells you anywhere on, on the earth or the ocean. So if you're a sailor, what you can do is you can pre program your route. And then what you can do is set the boat in the direction that you want it to go. And then what happens is the computer speaks back to you to let you know whether you're on course, off course, or whether you need to adjust your course to get to the coordinates. And then when you get to your key milestone coordinates, you know that there's something significant that needs to happen, like a change in direction or something that's involving your course. So we just want to go straight at this point. Yeah. But if it says to the right or to the left, you need to tell the person driving to go to the right or to the left. Okay. Zero point three two mm straight left. Okay. So what is it telling you? Slight left. Slight left. Do another D. So now you know you're 800 feet, and you want to hear that number get smaller and smaller. Yeah. I just reset the destination to go back to the marker. I now have us all set up for these guys to drive us back to the, the channel entrance. We're, we're 0.2 nautical miles, straight ahead. A little more to the left, Bill. So, your pilot actually has found the marker, so we, we're there. We're, we're just within, hey you guys, give, give our driver a hand. Life without limits. I mean, it's so much more liberating to go out and set your own expectations and your own um, standard and then let other people give their own take on that rather than have people define you. And the more people you bring into that, which is what No Barriers right. does, it really right just builds a community of which people Look really want once. to um, help each other. And yet they lead very satisfying and successful lives.